Uh oh. Suddenly a voice could be heard echoing forth from the Leela shell. Unisha, can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. Everything okay? Yes, yes, don't worry. I just wanted to let you know that the Knights have all arrived back at base safe and sound. That's good. I'm glad to hear it. Cadna's also reported in from Rado's Annex. It's still going to take some time to dispel the barrier around Lady Fina, apparently. Okay. Is there anything I can do to help them? Well, about that. Commander Galleon wanted me to pass a message along to you. He said you should proceed to the tower summit on your own for now. Uh, all the way to the top? On my own? Yeah, he seems very confident in your abilities. I'll say. But he also wants to make sure you take care not to act rashly. You're bound to run into some serious danger up there. Well, okay. I'll do what I can. Thank you, Unisha. Best of luck to you. Let's roll! What? Oh, are those new sorcerers up there? Hi, guys! Okay, this thing is dangerous. This thing needs to be taken out and pop. Okay! Okay, the, the, oh, they're the undead kind, and they're... Okay. They're the undead ones who stick their hands into the ground. And these hands shoot out huge frickin' laser beams. That's quite a thing for you to, uh, use, guys. Just, just, whatever this thing is, this thing's very dangerous. It's probably like a demon flower. How much you want to bet it was a demon flower? Er, I, I don't, I'm not really looking to bet. I'm just using a cliche. It's called a lily bored. That does sound like a flower. A strange-looking demon in a strange-looking shell. Okay, so it's not a flower, although it is rooted in the rooted in the ground. Come to think of it, do they have any information about this? Uh, that the last boss. You've got Geldy. I remember that guy. What a surprisingly lucky. Or I'm not going to say it was easy. It was, it was just lucky. Source those freaking demon chickens. And we've been through a lot. We've been through a lot, haven't we? The giant thunder centipede demon. The unbeatable Kishgal. Geldy, who we beat in two tries. The, you know, lava robot. This abomination that uh, Zava was so in love with. Consclard, the most horrible demon in the tower, probably. And Pictimos. A mantis-like demon that rules over the blighted blood tier. It's keen eyesight and quick... Okay, it has an extremely cruel nature, taking great pleasure in hacking its prey to pieces. So it is like an animal, because it has prey, and it's also a big jerk. So, no worries. I'm wondering why there are a few blank pages, though. Maybe if you play through with Hugo and whatever, whoever the last character is, you'd uh, get them filled in. I remember our fight with Epona. We haven't seen her since then. She was probably the most... Or the least dislikable of the villains, but she's still a jerk with no redeeming qualities. And I remember Valagunder, the first big monster that we took on. Already we've been through so much in this tower. Hopefully this tower will be demolished, and this whole crisis will end finally. But, you know, maybe I'm getting it. Maybe we're getting ahead of ourselves there with that, with that kind of hope. Kind of ironic, I guess. We're spending the game exploring this tower, and our mission is probably, ultimately, to see it, if not destroyed, certainly, um, you know, the people, the, the demons who built it, gone, and the tower, you know, over and done with. Although maybe, maybe it's not, maybe our mission, maybe, actually, come to think of it, this game is sort of apocalyptic, isn't it? I mean, like, they, they like, they can't survive on the surface. That's pretty serious stuff. Wait, why am I on this platform? Is there anything over here? Anything new? No, just more demons? Okay. Yeah, more demons. Nothing nothing new. We've dealt with more demons this poison than Doom Guy has. 
And that guy dealt with a lot of demons. Okay, I'm not I'm not doing so good this time. Let's try that again, and this time not not do so bad. Sounds like a plan, wouldn't you agree? Wouldn't wouldn't you agree? Got a statue. You agreed. Trust me. I I, I can recognize these things. I've I've met known a lot of statues in my life and once you, once you get to know them, you can come to appreciate a lot of uh, things about their subtle methods of expression. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh. Hey, guys. Hi. New... Whoa, dude, dude, dude. These are very powerful. Um. Oh, I'm in confused mode. I hate it when this happens. That being said, I think we have definitely found the most dangerous kind of, of uh, slime in the entire game. There is no way it could get more dangerous than completely, you know, throwing our controls off. If we were dealing with, like, other enemies at the same time, that'd be very bad. We, we, we should take those guys out first. Oh! Hi! 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 Quit, quit, quit hurting me, you jerk! It's... Uh, well... All con in all fairness, I'm trying to... I'm trying to hurt them too. Oh, okay. I feel like I was doing much better the first time I was in this area. I, I, I like I was doing so good, and now here I am, not doing not doing very good at all, honestly. What happens to what? What, what happened, huh? Oh, fine. Let's just revert to. I almost feel like it's cheating using this. Really do. But not quite. You know, no, it's it's not that bad. In any case, if it gets too bad, we can of course always just uh, you know, uh, teleport to the uh, goddess statue. Oh, hey, on the subject of slimes, I need to eliminate immediately. There are a few right here. Hi, guys. Wanna wanna meet me? Cut. Hi. It, and bye. Oh no, there's still one of them still left. No, what the heck? Did that just, like, reconstitute itself? Can they do that? Oh, darn. They can. I forget. Well, I mean, it's not reconstituting itself. It's just du duplicating itself. And, of course, they can do that. That's part of their shtick. That's what slimes do in this game. Is they duplicate themselves. And I really hate these blade-throwing demon flowers called... What are they called? Like, petunias or something? What a bunch of joits. I bet you that in, like, the war slang used by the Holy Knights, these guys are called something about, you know, something about being flowers. You know what? Forget it. For it forget it! I said forget it, jerk! I didn't really forget it, obviously. Oh, when you kill them, the blade part d disintegrates, too, even if it's not attached. Interesting. Wonder how that works. These demons and their wacky biology. Who's next? Oh, it's, it's this one of these guys. Yeah, without the uh, horrible, horrible blade things around, that's not really. I'm not really so worried about the, uh, you know, sorcerer guys. And I am not going to go down there. I'm going to keep going this way. Actually, hold on, hold on. What am I doing? I have an item that will regenerate my health if I just stand still. I'm aware that standing still is not the most, you know, exciting thing to do. But, you know, what's effective is effective. And there's no denying that. <whistles> yep. We're almost back. Almost back full health. I'll, I'll, we're back. Uh. Yeah, silver chimes. Although it looks like we're going to find another item for that, uh, 
category of the, you know, of our inventory later on here. Huh? Hey guys, what's going on here? Oh, hi guys! Oh, dude! The enemies here are really crazy in this, like, techno area. On the subject of that, well, if this is... Why is it called the Demonic Core? Is this somehow where the... I don't know, where the demons are coming from? Because that doesn't make sense, does it? I thought the demons were supposed to be, um... Pop, you know, somehow spawning from, like, the Black Pearl. They couldn't be coming out of the tower, like, at least not originally. Because the tower was supposed to be, um... Like, they built the tower after they were already attacking, right? I mean, I think so. I, I might be missing something here. Wouldn't be the first time. Jump! Jump! Made it. Is there any, any, anybody here? Oh, hi! Hi! I don't like you very much. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Oh, God! The, the slime! Okay, they, okay they, they got me with their freaking... I'm just... I'm practically... It's almost like I'm p pressing random buttons. And I know that's not the way I should be doing it, but what can I say? Ah. We're going to meet the last new up here, I bet ya. Those news have been very helpful to us over o over time, haven't they? Over the uh, rich years that we've um, uh, been we've been traveling through this tower. I mean, it's kind of unbelievable, isn't all this just taking place in the course of like a day, or like maybe just a few days? Like, how is it exactly that? Like, like, are they getting to the top of this tower by just fighting for like a day? Because those demons mustn't actually be all that strong if they can't even hold back this small group of knights from getting completely from top to bottom in their fortress, you know, over the course of just a, of a few days. Now quit, quit slicing me, you joik! I gotta quit doing that, because, I, I mean, I understand that it's not a matter of being a jerk. Like, th th these guys, I, I mean, y y you know, I'm trying to kill them. Even if they're even if they're demons, I don't think they really have a will. Like I don't, I don't know that they have like a free will to, that could even be qualified as being a you know, jerky. Oh, so hi guys. So you guys are doing all this throwing blades around, you guys. I don't appreciate that very much, you guys. Here, it'll work eventually. It's just so hard to deal with that many of them all at once. And if I'm standing in the middle, I'm just gonna get hurt. So, I'm just going to use the range attack on them, give them a taste of their own medicine, even though my medicine that I'm giving them is significantly less effective than, than theirs. I feel like I lost the metaphor along the line somewhere there. Ah, oh, well. This, this, uh, are those, like, guardrails along the side? Are they, are they holograms? Or are they, say, glass with a pattern on them? Or some just some sort of magical projection that is in effect equivalent to a, um, a hologram, but is you know not. I don't know. That's a very fast way to take care of them. I wish I'd just done that before. Oh, did it guard? How did that work? Eh, didn't guard that well. Hi. Is this going to open up a bouncy circle? Oh, it's a teleport point! We have not seen a teleport point for, um, uh, at least a while. Wonder where it'll teleport us to. I don't know, I'm gonna let my health regenerate first, because wherever it takes us, they're probably going to be more demons, because this is, after all, the demonic core. Oh, it's not a teleport point, it is like a jump point. Alright. Oh, and there's the there's the Rue back there. Anyway, um, yeah. So hi guys, hi how, how you doing guys? You guys, you guys doing well? You not, you're not doing well? I don't want you to be doing well because you're trying to kill me, guys. I don't appreciate it, people trying to kill me. I, I mean, maybe in your culture you just greet people by murdering them. It could be. It's just a case of of my cultural ignorance that I don't know that that you don't really mean me any offense by murdering me. Just kidding, that's, uh, of course you're trying to kill me. That's terrible, and you're not nice because of demons and you're fine. The world will be better off without... Oh, crap! Do I not have that I I don't have that item equipped. So that was all 
that effort was all for a knot. But not with that guy. Hi. You gonna come back to life in a sec here? Yeah, you are. Hi. Quit being alive, please. Thank you. Well, I guess it wasn't alive. It was undead, wasn't it? So which way am I gonna go? I'm gonna go up first? Yeah, I'm gonna go- Oh, gee! Ah! They caught me by- They caught me by- Surprise! Why I got- Oh, they can come down here now. Okay. That's fine. I, I don't really- I, I'm not bitter or anything. What would make you- What would give you that impression? Oh, there's another one! Shooting his hands at me! Just- Just like, you know, I'm just walking along and he just starts shooting his hands at me. I wish I could grow my hand- Regrow my hands like that. That'd be great. I mean, not that I'm, like, missing hands. It'd be very difficult to play this game if I- was tr you know didn't have hands but but as it is I mean you know if if I were to lose my hands I would like to be able to get them back quickly maybe if maybe research into stem cells is going to let us do that someday that day is not the day that I'm recording this unless they did you know figured it out today and the news just hasn't I just haven't learned that they have yet that's very possible of course I, I, I tend not to be on top of the developments in the scientific community Although I really wish I, I were, because that stuff's interesting. I wonder if the demons have scientists. I don't think so, they don't seem very smart. But this demonic core does seem science-y, doesn't it? With those holograms and those, I don't know, big purple neon lights they have. Maybe this is like a demon city, and that's what those big purple lights are. Although maybe, who knows, maybe this entire tower is in some is in some very uh, real measure just a um, uh, you know demonic city. After all, the demons are all gathered here. I mean, it doesn't have a lot of the hallmarks of a city. Like I haven't found any like oh these guys can confuse me too. Like I haven't found any say uh, um, I don't know what you'd call them institutions. You know, like I haven't found any de demon uh, you know like banks or anything. What do the demons do when they need money? I don't know. They clearly don't go to a bank, though. Let's just take care of these guys right now as quickly as, po as, quickly as possible. I took care of all those guys, and I didn't get confused. Let's go down here and see who awaits us here. Oh. There's a staircase above this, and this circle will probably be an important mechanism later, but I need to turn it on. Oh, God! Oh. Okay, so I'm sorry. At the same t at the at the same time that this uh, jumpy guy fella leaped down at us, I was um well caught off guard because there was also at the same time there was a thunder strike outside. Thunder strike! I mean a lightning strike. There was thunder. That's the point I'm trying to get at. I always hate the confused status in games. Like, whether it's this kind of confused or the kind of confused in RPGs where one of your party members will just begin randomly attacking your team and the enemy team, too. That's always terrible. It, it, it's quite a... it's just a nuisance. I mean... Oh, God, you did it again! Ugh. Oh, God. These demons just freaking... They, they have no concept of personal space. Well, that's... I shouldn't... Who am I to, to apply my human y y cultural standards to the demons? Why am I even talking about demon culture? They're demons! They don't have a culture! They just seem- well, they, but they do, kind of, because it's been established that, like, you know, those praying mantis men had, like, elders and stuff. Even if they're sadistic or, or, or whatever, there's still some kind of- this, this, there's, like, more than just un- like, just rabid unreason there. There's apparently, at least to some- enough organi social organization and social structure that they can have a, um, some kind of culture. And also, I am low on health and just needed to win already. Take, 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 take. No health there. Which doesn't matter, because I have a cloak that'll let me get all my health back. But first, I need to take out all the demons so I can stand STILL long enough to take advantage of that. Also, let's go get that loot. Oh god, oh, okay, that's so much better. Wait, isn't Unisha's health already higher? How does that work? Did that last enemy drop some sort of health item? Or... I don't know. I don't know. Oh, hi! 
Oh, hi! Let's, uh, not go up there yet. Just kidding, let's go up there. This is a- it's not good to fight them on an incline like that. It just doesn't work out very well in this game. Although, and frankly, you shouldn't- in, in general, in, in battle, you want to have the, um... The high point anyway, don't you? Now I just need to figure out how to get down to the treasure chest. Let's see... I'll figure it out. Don't worry. Don't you worry your little head off. Wait, was there something this way? No, there wasn't so Well, I mean, there's something up there. But I'll get to that later. Unisha can't jump that high even with her double jump. I suppose she just needs to do more squats. Then her legs would become even more muscular and she would be able to get up there. Who wants some? Oh, I forgot once again to equip the silver chime. But these little things rising up on the side there, those sort of little porch-like things, what are those? Are they supposed to be... I guess they're the, like, demon pollen from the uh, Blighted Blood area. They remind me a little bit of um, those little red fireballs that, uh, you know, represent, like, you know, ghost fire. Uh, or at least that's what the Japanese call it. I normally think of them as Willow the Wisp. The Obsidian Key. Obsidian is one of those words that is simply very, I don't know, sort of impressive. I don't even know what obsidian is, though. I'm pretty sure it's like a kind of rock. Okay, I took that one guy out very quickly. Will I take this guy out quickly? Yeah. Yeah, I will. Now we're gonna get up to that higher ledge that I referred to earlier. See? More, more loot! More. What is it? The silver dress. That doesn't even sound like proper armor, but I'll take it. A white dress woven with claria thread, blessed by the goddesses. Oh, I see. This is just high class armor, but this, but but this is like spiritual level level stuff. All right. I'm still- it's still interesting that they're using Claria, even though it's the source of their problems. Of course, all things have a good and bad to them, but... I don't know. I wonder where they're going with this. Like, wh what are the- who are the bad guys, and what are they doing? And, like, what's their goal? I mean, at this point, their goal just seems like to be really mean while trying to capture the goddesses, but... But why, though, exactly? I mean, if they're trying- I guess they're trying to control the demonic energy? But don't th but, but they already are controlling demons, aren't they? Don't they already have that going for them? Or, or does it give them greater power over them or something? Is that what their goal is, to like, completely control them? I don't know. Really don't. Maybe we're gonna find in here- maybe, maybe in here there's gonna be a nice, uh... A nice, old-fashioned... Ah, uh, a nice old fashioned fashion goddess statue. Okay, they confuse me. I don't know. I confuse myself sometimes. I've never been so confused though that when I my I think that I'm walking forward, I'm walking backwards. But there's another one. Yeah, I should probably check the like the book on like my be the bestiary and see what these fellows are called. After I kill this one, I mean. Know thine enemy, after all. Let's see. I overstepped it a bit there, didn't I? Wait! Wait, hold on. So we're actually that close to where, where the bosses are? We really are near the end, aren't we? It's... I don't know. I, I feel like the slight melancholy quality of the music is, is, is somehow very fitting for that. Anyway. So, those spinning guys are Fleogans. 
Mad demonic warrior that constantly cheats death. Its spinning attack can confuse foes, but it's always preceded by a telltale step back. That's good to know. And I gotta say, so far they haven't done a very good job cheating death in Maya well, when, when Unisha has been around, but I don't know. I get the impression Unisha is almost an impossibly good soldier in comparison to everyone else. We have news, the purple news, and the uh, hand sorcerers here are Bezarena. Bezarena. Yeah, they're f stronger than the Zaru Zaruena. Arms can fire lasers. And its main body can generate its own shield. Its arms shoot lasers! That's just crazy. That, I, I gotta say, I'm not so sure that I can believe in a, in a being whose arms just, just naturally shoot lasers. Oh! I mean, its arms could be used as a remote control. Like, maybe they could modify it so it can have remote control arms. And then they could turn the TV on and off from a distance. I'm, but who watches? I don't watch TV anymore, though, so it wouldn't be very helpful to me. Oh, goddess. Let us reveal your true beauty from this demon that encases you. The crystal's power purified the demon statue. Ah. It's a good thing these demons just happened to, you know, space these goddess statues they stole throughout their, uh, throughout their power like this. It'd be very difficult for us if they hadn't done that. So what else do we have here? Extend, uh, drop item attack, increase boost recovery. Um... How many do I have? I have 85,000, but I need 160,000 for that and 100,000 for that. So okay, I, I guess I just have to keep on trucking. To uh, borrow a phrase that was uh, Ness's mother used. This must be the obsidian doorway. Okay, there's a boss in here. Let's go. Let's go save again, just to be safe. Let's save. You, you know, actually, now that I think about it, maybe I should get my armor upgraded while I'm here too. Yeah, twelve thousand spiritual points isn't that many, really. Subject that how how strong am I now? Is it really that big of a difference? I don't know. I don't know if it is or not. And I probably should have saved before I, I I mean after I did that rather than before. Anyway, let's go. Zava, you gonna be here? What what the the tower? What's happening to it? Uh... Um...
What in the world is going on? Dallas started the ritual, of course. You! Ah, what? Hey, I was I was about to say long time no see. Well, okay, long time no see, Unisha. I'm honestly kind of surprised you made it this far. Must have gotten a lot better with that axe since the last time we met. I'll choose to ignore that comment if you tell me more about this ritual. Don't know all that much about it myself, honestly. Or rather, I heard all about it, but didn't really understand a word. The general gist, though, is that when it's finished, that flying shrine of yours is going to come crashing down. Solomon Shrine is going to fall? B but why? Beats me. Dallas says it's so he can make the demonic essence complete or some such thing. And then the Age of the Darklings will begin. That's the only part I do get, and naturally I like the sound of it a lot. I... I'm not going to let that happen. Ugh. Well, you don't have a whole lot of choice anymore. You're pretty much too late. We already caught the other goddess. Lady Rhea, does that mean you have the Black Pearl too? Black Pearl? I guess you could call it that. Hell of a lot bigger than any pearl I've seen, though. But yeah, we have it. Dallas took it for, from the goddess to use in the ritual. No. <laughs> Guess you East folk lose. Too bad. So what do you say? You in the mood to finish our fight now? I'll bet you're pretty mad at me. Might do you some good. <laughs> Though I won't be holding back, so you'd better be ready. Oh, I'm ready. Are you? I'll be damned if I let you stop me here. Alright, fine. Time to finish what we started. This time we both have ranged attacks! Although personally, I expect that both with, in both of our cases, they're not going to be very effective against the other. In any case, bad stuff has gone down with that with old Solomon Shrine. I don't know, should I use the axe against her or... Okay, you know, you know I'm going to use... The, I'm, I'm going to go, go, go with the old axe. Worked last time? It, wh wh why fix what's broke? What, what, what's, if it's not broken, why would I fix it? That just would be, would be silly. Okay, that. Okay. Okay, it, she, she's a lot faster this time, or I think she is anyway. Oh, she has the same kind of shield that those uh, one hand sorcerers use. That's not really a compliment, though. I, I mean, those guys are kind of, you know, dead. Come on, come on, take it. Okay, 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 okay. I, I'm not, I'm not do. I am doing very poorly. Okay. Um. Well. Whatever. I have a feeling of all the bad guys. I feel like that Epona is the one who's most likely to end up. Uh, I don't know. Not necessarily having some kind of turnaround, but. No, exactly that. I, th I think she's the one who's most likely to. I mean, I don't know why I feel that way. She hasn't exactly done anything that suggests some kind of redeeming qualities. Although she wasn't a complete jerk in her speech before this battle, which is more than we can say about most of the other antagonists, who really just seem to revel in the jerk thing. But, uh, hey. I mean, may who am I to judge? Actually, I'm a decent person who isn't, you know, mindlessly, unquestioningly following an evil sorcerer. So I, I feel like I'm in a, in a good position to judge, you know, all things, all things considered. Although, of course, as they say, the man who's wet can't possibly understand the man, or the man who's dry can't possibly understand the man who's wet. Or is it the man who's hot can't understand the man who's cold? I forget how it goes. In any case, I think it's a pretty good quote. And I also think that an uh, old opponent here isn't going to win unless she pulls something like that giant praying mantid boss bit. Personally, I expect- OH DEAR! Okay! She's uh... A am I seeing duplicate here? Yes, the answer is yes, by the way. I absolutely am. Is it like one of them's the real one? Okay, she's definitely- 
She 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 did have a, something up her sleeve then. Okay, okay. They're, this is bad because they're they're not like in a group anymore. Okay, how how do is there some way I can identify which one's the real one? Okay. Okay. Are they all the real ones? I mean, I'm not sure. I, I'm kind of a little too focused on the on what I'm like. I'm watching the battle to know if, like, when I hit one, if that's damaging all- if that's just- Like, it doesn't matter which one, it'll bring down our health bar. I think that that is what the case is. I sure hope so, because otherwise, this is very difficult. Okay, just get just get just get it, just get it! We're getting it! We're gonna get it! Did we get her? We got her! Damn. I can't believe how strong you've gotten. I guess I should have trained a little more before confronting you. I've got to hurry. Wait for me, Lady Rhea. I'll set you free somehow or another. Are you gonna, like, take her weapons? Hmm? What's this now? A magic artifact? Might come in handy. Sorry, but I'm taking this with me. Just, just rod? Not a, like, a mineral rod or, or millennium rod? Just rod? Okay. Are you sure you don't want to take her weapon? You, are you sure? I, I mean, she is the enemy, you know? Are you sure you... Yeah, she, she doesn't want to. Also, what's that attack? What the, what the heck was that attack she just used? How do you... I, I don't know what it was. Well, I suppose we're going to repeat the same mistake as uh, our old friend yesterday did a few games ago. When he left that big torturer guy just, just sitting there unconscious instead of, you know, taking his weapon. Ah, well. Probably, as with his case, it's not actually going to come to haunt us. Do I? I still don't have enough spirit points. Oh well. Oh, oh well. Well, now what? What, what? what do I do with a rod? I, I mean, is it like Sun Wukong's iron rod? Because I don't think that's what it was. But then again, you wouldn't know Sun Wukong's iron rod was a powerful weapon if you saw it in its normal, you know, size of a, of a sewing needle state, now would you? The answer by... Ah, darn it! I freaking okay. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be. You know, there's an interesting contrast between this tranquil title screen and the very violent game within. I mean, looking at this title screen, you can't even see how the surface of the Earth has been completely devastated by demons. That tower is still there, though.